What's up? It's uh, August 27th, UFC Day, Anderson Silva Day. <laughs> the UFC pay-per-view Rio is going to start pretty soon in a couple minutes. I mean, watching that, I was watching the prelims and stuff on Facebook, and Spike TV is some pretty good fights so far, and there's some awesome fights lined up on the pay-per-view. I can't wait to watch that, and then starting pretty soon. And then right after Anderson Silva knocks out this uh, this Yushin Okami guy, whoever that is, this nobody, <laughs> you know, then I got to um, book it down to the to Blaisdell and watch some MMA Live myself, you know, there's going to be, um, Kendall Grove is going to be fighting, uh, BJ Penn's brother, um, and what's the name of the guy, Andrei Orlovsky, he's going to be fighting too. It's going to be awesome. The only thing that sucks is, um, I want, after that is over, I want to go watch, um, my friend Sean Davenport and the Sedated Nation play at Wine Bryan's right down the road. But I found out that they start at 8.15, so I, I'm probably going to miss it. Which sucks, but we'll see. Maybe maybe the fights will end early at the blaze, though. Hopefully, and I'll get to go see them. That'll be awesome. Uh, here we go. It's starting right now. I'm watching it. I'm not going to show anything to you guys because I don't want the UFC suing me <laughs> for putting anything up on YouTube. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Here's the fight. Nah, not really. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Anderson Silva, best in the world, best ever. No one's ever gonna beat him. You know, hopefully he'll get to go and beat up GSP and go beat up John Jones sometime soon. <laughs> Cause no one's got nothing on this guy. Yo, so I just got here, just parked the car. There's the exit, but I gotta go all the way around the whole parking lot cause it's one way, so. Getting out of here at the end of the night might kind of suck. Anyways, I got the tickets. Gotta go find Aaron now. It'd be funny if he got tired of waiting and he went and bought his own ticket. <laughs> we'll see. Let's go find him. There he is, kind of look cool, hanging on the, the ledge over there. <laughs> record of 15 wins and 9 losses. Training out of Jackson MMA. Let's welcome the former UFC heavyweight champion, Andre the Pitbull Arleski. <laughs> <laughs> This is Aaron, and this is the effect Aaron has on people when he's on YouTube. People don't follow me. We almost had one like that, it was kind of like that today, but luckily that when she was like that, she would like kind of catch herself and she would like just kind of like get up. It's right there.
Mr. Peace is on Twitter. Uh, you know, I'm not everything. Everything is not everything right now. I believe I stopped it. I stopped it then and I started again because there's the drill. And then got it. <laughs> <laughs> give, give your recount the the, the following <laughs> events. <laughs> Tell everyone why did you not help the old person? You help old people every day at work. Why didn't you help this one? She fell down. She could have broke a hip. It makes you feel better. You are the one filming it. <laughs> For the, For the record, that was awesome. For the record. <laughs> I knew it was happening. I knew it was coming, so I recorded. So that's but then I works. stopped. I stopped because no. I was like, God, it's not going to happen. You, you can't stop rocking oh, for a little God. bit. So I stopped it. And then I saw him drooling, so I wanted to capture the drill. So I zoomed up on him, and then he fell over. It was amazing. See, that's even worse. Now I know you could have prevented it. <laughs> Okay, so we went to the MMA thing at the Blaze though. It was pretty good. We saw a lot of famous people there. Not necessarily famous, but known people. You know, like BJ Penn, his wife. What's the other guy's name? Chris Levin and his wife or girlfriend or whoever that was. Mostly we see Egan Inoy, MMA Hawaii legend. Oh, yeah. Who else was there? The Strike Force, former Strike Force uh, matchmaker, was there. Big John. Big John McCarthy was there. No wonder he wasn't at the UFC Britain Rio thing today. He was over here. He had better stuff to do. <laughs> um, oh yeah, Leland from Dog the Bounty Hunter, and the, the other guy on Dog the Bounty Hunter that nobody knows. So is Jens Pulver. He was there too. He was the commentator. Uh, you know, he was the Joe Rogan of pro MMA elite. So Kendall Grove won. He was the main event. And he uh, clarified why he's the main event at, in his interview and then. Because he brings it. <laughs> That's why I was the fucking main event. Because I bring it. You know what I mean? We ended the night here at Next Stop Zippies. Sponsorship, right? No, no. <laughs> and then we saw the highlight of the night right here at Zippy's. An old man fell down off his chair and I got it recorded. YouTube gold. Roll it. A million hits right there.